So let's talk to with the least popular broadcaster in history. He's basically unemployable, angry, and unathletic. Mm. I'm talking about Keith Oberman, who's taking a shot at Riley Gaines for the most ridiculous reason. First off, this. Uh, defining a woman equals ridiculous uh, equals ridiculous. This according to State Senator Megan Hunt. Remember that next time elections, uh, uh, next, next election, Nebraskans. So this is the dialogue that goes on on a regular basis between your kids, uh, between your sports, between your athletics. And now Keith Oberman responds, can you just adjust reality and move past it? You sucked at swimming, said, as he's just talking about Riley Gaines. That's why you lost. Second team all conference. Happily for nasty, stupid, unsuccessful, transphobic Riley Gaines. She has no reputation to ruin, which is insane. For one thing. Keith Oldman's never accomplished anything athletic in his life. This is a Division I athlete who is all SEC first team, three SEC titles, the second place finished nationally, and qualified to almost qualify for the Olympics, actually competed in the U.S. trials for the Tokyo Games. Out of all the things to go after Riley Gaines, you cannot go after her success as a swimmer. What you can do is go after Leah Thomas, who tied with her. So Leah Thomas, who's really a man, was a super mediocre swimmer. There you go. And tied with her for in, in this championship that you see here. And then the NCAA said, um, even though they were tied, told Riley Gaines in that picture, uh, when they had to take the podium, they said, we're going to let Leah Thomas, the man, take the podium, not you. And she said, why? I tied with him. Why can't we both stand on? They said, we can't tell you why. He's, so the message to women is that the best women are men. And this is the, this is the battle that Riley Gaines is fighting. And why she said to the state senator, which also goes to our Supreme Court justice, who was also asked that question during her confirmation hearing, what is a woman? And she said, well, I, I'm not qualified to answer that. Well, darn it. Damn it. We ought to be able to answer what a woman and is. And she passed. Well, and she's on the Supreme Court, right? Now. Um, yeah, she's on the Supreme Court. Riley Gaines was a second team swimmer for two years before she made the first team, the final two years at the University of Kentucky. And after all of that back and forth, she went to formerly known as Twitter X and said this. All right, Keith, as I was getting my all SEC first team honors down to show you, I dropped it and I broke it. Which would be really unfortunate if I didn't have more of those, but lucky for me I do, so let's go through it. SEC title, uh, second in the country. This is my SEC Community Service Leader of the Year Award, which actually got me a lot of money. Oh, another SEC title, uh, an NCAA trophy. Oh, look, SEC Scholar Athlete of the Year. Believe it or not, I'm pretty smart. Another SEC title, another NCAA trophy. Oh, that's when we won an SEC championship as a team. Some more SEC honors. Oh, look, another one. <laughs> That's when I broke the 200 butterfly record, uh, the SEC record, which I still hold, making me one of the fastest Americans of all time. And so, Keith, I would be really sad if I broke this trying to prove a point to an old man who can't even seem to keep a job. But I've got more of these, so I'm not. Thanks, Keith. It's unbelievable. That was great. <laughs> even if you're recruited to, to go to Kentucky and swim, you're an elite athlete, let alone compete, win, and, and gain. Yeah. Out of all the weaknesses that you might have with Riley uh, Gaines, athleticism wouldn't be it. it this is, he's this, actually lost his mind. I was just going to say, this ideology has warped so many people's mind. When you can't define what a woman is, that you're willing, in order to defend men taking over taking over sports for women, you're going to demean a woman in all of her achievements. None of this makes any sense. Um, and, you know, I, I, I just think it's, uh, again, I love it's that upside she... upside down world. No, I love that she put the clown face. We are in clown world. Right. <laughs> in, her, in her little text message there, tweet message. So that